Hey guys and welcome to AK Pro Films, your source for tech tutorials and more. And on this video, I'm going to show you my top 5 ways of customizing your Mac and making it look the way you want it to look. So with no more further ado, let me show you how to customize your Mac in this video. So stay tuned. So moving right along with this video, let's jump right into it. So first I'm going to show you how you can change your dock size and all of those preferences. So you see this divider line right here? You can drag up to increase the dock size and drag it down to decrease the size of the dock. You can also go into system preferences, dock, and you can change the size from the smaller dock size to the larger dock size. You can also change the magnification so how much it magnifies when you hover over the dock. You can change that using the slider or you can turn it off entirely. You can also adjust the position on the screen on the left side or on the right side. And you can also customize the minimize windows using the genie or the scale effect. So the genie is when you minimize, it'll minimize like that. And the scale effect will scale it just like that. So that just brings us right into our second customizable tip, how you can open and close applications and how you can customize that. So that's minimize the windows and you can also double click the menu bar to minimize it. You can also minimize windows into the application icon instead of over here. So if I uncheck that, they will minimize over here instead of on the actual icon in the dock. And you can also animate when you press and open an application. So you can see how it bounces up and down when you open it up. You can also show or hide the indicator lights. So I'm just going to leave those on. So now let's move on to our third customizable tip for your Mac and how you can change the appearance of the windows on your Mac. So you want to go to Personal, General, and you want to go to Appearance. And this is the tab that you can customize the appearance of the windows on your Mac. So the blue setting will have the red as a close button, the yellow as a minimize, and the green for the scaling the window to the full screen. You can also change that to graphite, which will get rid of those colors entirely and just have it on the grayscale setting. So that's just a cool way to change your Mac appearance. Now moving on to our fourth customizable Mac tip, you can change the highlight color. So I have it set to gold right now. So if you open up pages, when you highlight over some text, that's the color that would appear. So I just have it on yellow like that. You can also change it to blue, which I personally like. You can change it to red and all these other color options as well. Also on the other section, you can actually customize your own color if you choose to do so. So that's just a very handy way of changing the way your highlight color looks. So I'm just going to set it back to blue. Now for the final Mac customizable tip, I will show you how to change your scroll bar settings. So when you scroll, how the scroll bar over here will function. I have it automatically based on the mouse or trackpad. You can have it set to when scrolling, they'll show up. So when you're scrolling, they'll show up. It's better when you're in a uh, internet browser, but you can see it shows up when I'm scrolling. And you can always leave the scroll bars on there for handy use if you prefer that setting. So these tips are all customizable to your liking. You can change them and change them whenever you want just to get the most out of your Mac. So that concludes our video. And please comment, rate, and subscribe if you found this video helpful. And please press that like button if this helps. And also in the comment section, leave your video suggestions and questions that you may have. So please comment, rate, and subscribe. And I will see you in the videos to come. Thanks for watching.